Hey everybody, Sean Terry here from theautomationblog.com and in today's video I want to show you a cool little timer on off instruction in the Micro 800. If you've only used RS Logics 5, 500, 5000, you may like this instruction. It's kind of everything rolled into one. Um, so with that, let's go take a look at the program here and we'll open up program number one and I'm going to add a new rung in here. And then let's go ahead and grab a block and we will look for the timer on off down here under the T's. There it is. Excellent. And I'm going to have that trigger and output here. And I think I'll use output number two. Let's go to output number two. Excellent. And then I also want a, let's see, reverse contact here in front of it. And here I want the uh, timer not to be done to be what triggers the timer. And so it's a local variable, but I need to clear this filter here, get rid of that bool filter. All right, there we go. You can see my default tag here is time uh, T on off underscore one. So I'll expand that, come down here and grab the Q, which is the output. Okay, so when the timer is not done, start it up. And uh, when the timer is done, we'll get this output here. Come on. But what I'm going to do here is now typically you'd put tags in here for the presets. But in my case, I'm just going to put the uh, time. I'm going to do uh, one second for both the on time and the off time. All right, let's go ahead and download it. When you do a download, it does a build for you. So we'll go ahead and do that. And we can see our run going true and false and true and false. And if we come over here, we can see we have a blinking light going on for one second and off for one second. And that's cool because we did it all in one instruction. So that's why I wanted to show it to you in case you've never used the Micro 800. Now, if you thought this video was helpful, then please give me a like and subscribe if you want to know about my future videos. And if you'd like to learn everything you need to know about uh, programming the Micro 800 line of programmable controllers to get started, check out my training course over at nano-basics.com. And if you'd like to support me in my work to bring more free automation articles and videos uh, online and help me take all the ads off the blog and off my videos, then consider making a $1 pledge over at patreon.com forward slash automation. And until next time, peace.